Hey everybody. So we are going to do a chicken in the stack cooker. Now, this is a great thing for if you're at a party, in a home party, but this is a great thing for a demo too if you're online for two reasons. If you're at a party, everybody gets some chicken, right? And that's a good thing. If you're home, you have dinner. So it's a great thing to do. Now, the stack cooker, okay? If you don't know a lot about whatever product you're demoing, don't be afraid to use your catalog. That's why it's there, okay? It's all described in here. And if you're at a party, you can tell people, you know, hey, I'm gonna use this. And if you look on page, the stack cooker, if you look on page 36, it'll tell you that it's got a three quarter quart seal and it's got a cone and it's got a colander. I'm going to put over here. Yes. And it's got a one and three quarter quart um, casserole, and it's got a three quart casserole. And for tonight, we're going to use the three quart casserole. We're going to use the one and three quarter quart, and we're going to use the cone. Now, this is one of the most fun recipes you can do. Your kids will love it. Your parties will love it. Just because it's super simple and it's quick, it's easy, and all you need is a microwave and a stack cooker. Now, first thing you wanna do is make sure you have washed and dried your chicken, okay? A lot of people are funny about raw meat. Doesn't particularly bother me, but if you are, that's okay, you can wear gloves. You can do any of the things that you wanna do. Remember, this is your demo, it's your party, your rules, okay? And you need some spices. And what I'm gonna to use tonight is I'm gonna use some paprika just because and the great thing about the paprika is it brings out the color in the chicken when you do the roasting. And this is like a rotisserie chicken. Now, the reason we're doing this tonight, stack cooker's not on sale. And that's okay, because that means whenever June is over, if somebody wants a stack cooker, you can still get it, okay? And stack cookers are a great thing to demo at your, at your parties because they're a high-end product. Your host can get it half price. If somebody else wants it and they're a little shaky on maybe their budget, they will book a party so that they can get it for your half price. So you can go ahead and actually demo our premium products without any problem at all. And we're using some garlic salt, just because I like garlic. And we are using some Old Bay seasoning because somebody told me it was a really good thing to use. All right, so we're just gonna mix that up in a bowl, okay? You can use fingers, do this, because you're gonna be talking the whole time, all right? And we're just gonna take this seasoning and you're gonna put it on the chicken. Not hard at all. And you can talk about how good the chicken is for you and the way that um, the stack cooker makes it so that it is so juicy when it comes out. I mean, when you think about cooking a chicken, is really the microwave the first thing you think of? But sometimes during the summer, you know, hot dogs and hamburgers on the grill are great, steaks on the grill are great, ribs on the grill are great. But sometimes it's raining and you can't use that grill. And sometimes it's just hot and it's not gonna happen. And you don't wanna heat the oven up because it's hot in the house. All right, this is the fun part. Now, talk to Nancy Lagan today. And she was telling me about this because there's different recipes for this. There's one where you can just lay it in here and after it cooks for a while, um, you can put stuffing, like a, a box of stovetop stuffing around it, put it back in the microwave for another five minutes, and you have chicken and stuffing, okay? But this is a fun one because it's just an easy thing to talk about. And Nancy said when she used to do parties, she would take this chicken, and you take the comb, and she said, and you just stick the comb up the chicken's wazoo. And I said, I could never do that but I just did. So maybe I could, I don't, I don't know. You know, it, it's kind of a weird thing to say, but whatever. And then you just set it down inside the three core casserole. And then you finish putting this on here like that. Okay. All right, guys, this is like it. Now you take the top. Okay. We're going to use, we're going to use the one and three quarter quart for a lid for this and you put it in the microwave and you microwave it six minutes for every pound of the chicken. This chicken's just a little over three pounds, so I'm gonna do it for right at 20 minutes. It's very simple, and I'm gonna tell you, I did one earlier today, and after about 10 minutes, it starts smelling so good. It smells like something you've had of it for 45 minutes to an hour, but there was no heat in the house. I mean, it was 90 degrees here today. There was no heat, 
There was none of that. It was just great. Now I'm going to show you the one that I already did because I'm going to cook that one. But this is how it comes out looking. Pay no attention to the part that we already ate. Okay. Um, it smelled good and we wanted a bite. But this is how it comes looking. It comes out looking like a rotisserie chicken. It smells awesome. And if you don't have a stack cooker right now, but you have one of the deep um, vent and serves, you can do it in a vent and serve. That works too. What I guess is the important thing to know about anything you're going to demo is have fun with it, make it short and sweet and simple when you're talking to people. And when you do things like that, they are going to want whatever you're demoing. When you like it, they're going to like it. So if you don't have some of these kind of things, but you have a can opener, even if you have the measuring cups, if you're in love with those measuring cups and the different sizes and the way the spoons will lay flat, they will want those if that's what you talk about. Now I'm gonna cook the chicken. I don't think we'll have time to come back, but it's gonna come out looking like this one only. It's gonna be in there and it is going to be amazing. If we have time, we'll come back. If not, I'll post a picture of it um, on Champion so you can see it. So Pam, that's it. It's short, sweet, and simple, and I love it.